The North Carolina Museum of Art, located in Raleigh, North Carolina on Blue Ridge Road, is a destination spot for art lovers of all ages. In the 1950s, the state of North Carolina acquired a bunch of works of art. Um, there was some different collections that people had, and it was given to the state of North Carolina um, to start its own collection. The museum was opened in April 1956 on Morgan Street in downtown Raleigh. It was called the Miracle on Morgan Street and was the first art museum in the country to be established using state funds. And ever since then, the collection has grown. We've kind of packed on other parts of land. NC State's vet school used to be right behind the museum. Um, that's now part of the current Jim and Ann Goodnight Museum Park. A new building was needed to properly house and care for works of art. In 1967, a new site for the museum was chosen. In 1983, the new building, now called the East Building, was opened. When we started off with paintings, um, I guess went to sculptures, and just recently uh, have also collected uh, photographs and um, other sort of media art, you know, videos and installation art. There are about 50 works of art um, photographs from uh, famous photographer Ansel Adams. Um, he does mostly outdoor photographs, uh, Yosemite Valley. All of our African collection was in the West Building. Um, it's being moved over here because there's a lot more space. The light levels uh, are going to be easier to play with because a lot of these African pieces have either wood or old paint or a lot of fabric in them. They're, they're fairly sensitive to light, so uh, it helps to put them in this building, which um, it's a little bit darker, there's less windows, we can control how much light um, hits some of those pieces. We have a whole education department here and their goal is to teach people about art. So field trips, you know, for me, I have memories of coming here to the museum in first grade and the banisters, I remember, there's one painting with a dog who looks like he's attacking a swan. I have a memory of looking at that painting and just being awed you know, by the detail and the color and just the, the composition of it. So now that I work here and I walk past that painting every other day, it is kind of neat um, how my own life was directly influenced by um, the museum being engaged with uh, some public schools. We do a lot of free events um, for the public. Most of our outdoors events, uh, they have ticketed um, events where you can come watch a movie or you can watch a band. We as a museum are just always thankful to the people who want to uh, endorse the museum, who want to pay for a membership or just give a, ge a generous donation um, because it's something that uh, is too often taken for granted. They have cash boxes near some of the exits and entryway points. We as a museum would not be able to function without volunteers. If you would like to donate or volunteer at the North Carolina Museum of Art, call 919-839-6262 or go online www.ncrmuseum.org.